Our Sugar CRM customers all use email. That's a known thing. So let's have a look at how we blend those worlds together. Here I am in my inbox and I can click down on an email message. But watch this trick. See the little black sugar cube in the corner? By clicking down on the sugar cube, I open a view into Sugar Connect. Sugar Connect provides me a view in the real time record of Sugar CRM. So while I'm reading an email, I can also glance across to the corresponding contact record and all the interactions that I've been recording and others have too. I can see emails, cases. I can also go up here and drill down on the account name to also look at more information about the organization, all the things that have been going on, other emails, and other contacts that I can interact with. Who else do I know? What meetings have been happening? Are there open tasks? Do I have phone calls? Or would I like to schedule one? I can read email and I can reply to email, of course, as well. By going and replying to this email, you'll notice the sugar cube is also available in the con corresponding email. I can quickly insert a template to simplify my response back to Eric. By leveraging templates, I can quickly choose an email template and that will compose the email for me, which even has merge fields, so it's writing the right response back to the person. I can archive this email as well on the way out the door and hit send. So what else happens in an inbox? If I go back here and read an email from Tanner, what you'll notice is as I'm reading the email, Sugar Connect responds and does not recognize his email address. I now have the option to both consume data from our research tool called Hint, and I can also add that contact into the database. You'll notice that it automatically captures his first name, his last name, his email address. I can also align his record with the existing account found in CRM, and it will even recognize there's an address existing and add that to his contact record automatically. All I have to do is hit save, and now I've created Tanner in CRM. I can now see his corresponding record. I can drill down on the account name again and see that account and the other people that I know at the organization already. By going back up top here to the kebab menu, I can drill down into Sugar. This drills me down from the email message into CRM. And I can now see the account and the newly created Tanner Fink record as well. I can drill down on that and I can start taking action just like I always do when I use CRM. If you'll notice over here in the timeline, it's already captured that email that came in from Tanner by creating the record in Connect. Using my inbox together with Sugar Connect really simplifies how I use CRM and it makes it simple for me to do things that I need to do back in the CRM database while I'm triaging email into the system. It's really been a big game changer for me and how I operate every day.